To identify Tilia Cordata, I'll be looking for the following features. A grey, smooth bark, only becoming platy when the tree is of significant age. The white, umbrella-like flowers, born in clusters of three to five, yet not always hanging down, sometimes born relatively erect on this species. And these flowers then forming the fruit, which are small, green, felty nutlets with very small ribs, uh, again attached to this green, papery bract that hangs down from the spray. The leaves and buds alternate on the twig, and the leaves noticeably heart-shaped, thinner and more likely to flutter in the wind than Tilia platyphyllus. So a closer look at the leaves, cordate, or in other words heart-shaped with a red petiole, and light serration around the leaf margin and a short acuminate tip. The crown form, when semi-mature to early mature, is a broad triangular shape with a lot of the branches relatively upright or upsweeping. And the winter buds alternate on the twig, a green, sometimes burnished red over that green, and formed of only three bud scales. The last bud scale often overlapping uh, the other two to form a slight nib at the end, rounded, and as I said, alternate on the twig.